This is so echo. It might work. What's up, mate? So we're just arriving to our second destination. It's about 20 hours from mainland, so really, really far away. There's no internet, no nothing like that. Just a lot of big fish. Epic sunrise to start the day, and that's the island behind us. Three islands. Just, <laughs> I don't know what to expect. I'm just frothing to explore these islands. Really, really frothing about because it has crazy lagoon area. I don't even think it's been fished before that we know of, so it could be absolutely mayhem. So yeah, really excited about this um, expedition and frothing to get into day two. So let's do it. Yo, Let's go. Yep. Cool. That's okay, cool. Thank you. Uh, I'll communicate around midday, I guess. Yeah, yeah, thank you. Yo. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna paddle over this way, try and fish the reef edge over here. Super good conditions today. Look how calm it is. Really crazy. Well, I've been kayaking for a while now and I just found the drop off. Check this out. Really deep. Really scary. So yeah, I'm gonna fish there. <laughs> The kayak's not too heavy tied onto this rock. Alright, let's get set up and we'll go fishing off this edge. Oh, big something out there. Alright, we're walking out to the edge. At the moment, it's still pretty deep. The tide is going out, so it should get lower. Big strike. Don't know what that was. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, G GT. You first G. Oh, GT gone. Hook came out. Let's go again. That was cool. I keep getting long toms biting my line, so I hope it doesn't snap on a big fish. It'd be, be because of the um, long toms eating the braid, but yeah, hectic. Yeah, we're gonna keep walking up here and fish some spots we haven't fished yet. Standing wave, you can see all the water running out of the lagoon. Woo. Probably good fishing here. Wow. Very, very big. What is this? Oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get spooled here. I'm just hoping it goes out. Oh, dropped. That was an absolute monster. No. That was a giant. Absolutely smoked. All right, well. <laughs> I lost a very, very big fish. I don't know, like my drag was really tight already and that fish has pulled like crazy. If I had have even been more tight, I probably would have got pulled in. It's just feeling that the reef is, the reef is so like heavy. <laughs> yeah, the reef is so difficult to fish from shore here. I knew it was gonna be a challenge. 
especially on those big monster fish and yeah that's what happened just got smoked it never really ran out to the ocean it just stayed along the reef went to the bottom probably a massive gt felt like 40 kilo plus for sure anyways i'm gonna take a break have some food i think the tires just started coming back in so i only got a little bit longer i can fish this reef edge and then wait for the tide to come in and it'll fill up that lagoon more and we can fish in there there should definitely be trevally in that lagoon it looks super super crazy so yeah keen to check the lagoon out you Loch Ness monster lagoon monster Hello, hello, hello. Well, it's one billion degrees here and I don't know what's happening, but there's, yeah, can't get any hits. Just lost that monster. And then after that, nothing for hours. It's mental, I'm dying and no one's picking up. Hello, hello, hello. Pick me up, pick me up. <laughs> Perishing. Oh, I'm gonna keep trying to get picked up. If not, I'm just gonna put the kayak in the water and paddle 10 million miles back to the boat. Just carried this all the way down. I don't think my radio is working. I tried to call as well, nothing's working. Oh. Where? You're oh, that's okay. Take whatever. Something's better than nothing. Really bad fishing today. Were you good? I, I lost one really big fish. Yeah, the big one was huge. Thank you. Um, I know, but the video is crazy. Just unstoppable. Really? Yeah, like just. Yeah. Oh. The biggest rock you can see yeah. close to the water. Yeah, yeah like near there. Uh, we're just returning to the boat after a pretty hot, long morning session. Yeah, we're gonna wait a few hours, relax. That's the good thing about having a really nice mother mothership here. We can relax a bit, yeah. drink something cold. And then when the tide fills in, I'm gonna go into the lagoon and we're gonna see what sort of action we can get to there. So yeah, catch you guys at the lagoon. Woo. All right, big drop off. <laughs> big scary drop off down here. Woo. Okay. Thank you. Terima yeah. kasih. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Okay. See you. <laughs> Hopefully, somebody jump our lucky. Phew. All right, we're paddling away from that edge because it's really deep and scary. There's something big there. And we're paddling all the way to that sand island. And we're gonna fish this crazy looking lagoon. So let's go. We've still got a long way to paddle. <laughs> big mission. Sounding like big sharks behind me and stuff. Oh, we're just about to come off the shallow flats. Entering the lagoon. Wow. Looks incredible. I don't want to break the kayak and not be able to get back. Oh, really colourful fish. Come on, let's make this gaff. Yes! Almost to the island. Phew! Uh, what have we got here? Some dry coconuts. Really good looking fishing over there. That's where we're gonna fish I reckon. Epic. I'll tie this to a tree. Oh, should we do like a bird's eye view of this island? I'll get the drone up and then we can check it all out. Show you what we got.
Yep. Well. Oh. Oh. No. Well, that was a big fish. That was a big GT. Force cast in here. Are you kidding me? That was absolutely psycho. First cast. <sighs> oh, I guess we go again. Really psycho. Yep. The John bar. Oh, what? Oh, the cot. <laughs> That's a beautiful tropical Roy. We're getting back. Ew. <sighs> yep. Oh, drop. Starting to be heaps of fish in here. Yep. Oh, what is this? What? Crazy fishing. Oh. The fish in here are so aggressive. Look at him, he's going crazy. Beautiful long nose, I think. Baby long nose. See ya, bruh. Bluefin. Many, many bluefin. Where did they come from? They'll be behind that rock. Oh, oh, oh my god. Wow, really big. <sighs> they were massive. Beautiful. What, that's my first one ever. Passion fruit trout. But do you want to know something really psycho? I just heard a bomb. Bomb fishing here. Really crazy. Gonna get this hook out. Beautiful passion fruit trout. My first one ever. Oh. All right, I don't know if I filmed that, but whatever. <laughs> Keep going. What is that? That's a GT. You're kidding me. There's a Maori ras just here. The Maori Rass right in front of me. Huge Maori Rass. Really big one. No way. That is psycho. I can't see that way. Oh. The Maori Rass was just there. That was huge too. Yep. Vachon. Whoa. Lots of fish. Something really yellow. Smoke that lure. Oh, there he goes. Heaps of stuff came after that. Oh. Yep. One on, one off. Oh, what is this? Another one. Whoa. Whoa. He went under my feet. <laughs> Probably cast again and get another one. There's some bigger ones out there. The small ones keep grabbing it first. Hit. Yep. Oh. 
Oh, another yellow, yellow snapper. Whoa, there he goes. <laughs> Crazy, this little spot here. Oh, that was big. I don't know what that thing was. That was, was that a job fish? Oh, <laughs> just another yellow spotted snapper. So many of these here. Oh, it's just, this one's pink. Oh, he's off. He's over there and hooked me. <laughs> Let's keep walking. We'll go behind here. This is about as far as I can walk. Well, I want to keep walking and fishing, but I'm so far away already and my battery is about to want, run out, so i got to walk back to the island. A little bit unlucky, had a huge GT strike, lost the GT at the start, saw a massive Maori wrasse and it didn't take the lure. It was so close to me when I was casting, so yeah, probably not ideal. I think I can see big fish like swimming everywhere, so it's a pretty active place. Despite the bombing over there, there's bombing over there somewhere. I heard it before, but yeah, let's walk back now. Oh, I made it back. I'm absolutely rooted. I walked so far that way. Everything's all right. Oh, I'm gonna have a drink. What? Wow. Oh man, there's something in here. Yep. Oh, wow, big, really big. Oh, wow. Oh, no. Ah. Massive! Whoa! Big GT! For sure! No way! What am I gonna do? Wow! It's so shallow in here! Massive GT! 20 gram lure. Yep, wow, it's huge. Oi, I got an idea. I'm gonna get the kayak. Get the kayak. Yep, yep. It's a psycho. It might work. Whoa. Come on, Gabby. Oh, no, no. I was going to get the kayak and we could have drifted after it. Oh no! Oh. Devastated, absolutely devastated. Oh. Man, as soon as I switch back to light tackle, GT. Smash! Yep. Reefed. Back to heavy again, I guess. Right, I'm gonna try and see if I can spot the fish now. Not much time left. The home point has been updated. Please check it on the map. Oh, there. Oh, 
going all right wrong. Right, last few casts of the day and then we're going to start paddling back there. That was so crazy. Titan trigger. I definitely had my chances here. Light tackle, destruction, heavy tackle, nothing hits. Same old story. Now we're gonna try and paddle back to that boat very, very far away and hopefully not get eaten by some of those sharks that are swimming around. Let's go and do it. Ew. Well, I'm going to end day two's video right here. I think it's day two, I can't remember. But yeah, epic trip so far aboard Sea Safaris. Getting dropped off in some crazy spots. Cab dogs being a little bit unlucky with landing some fish. But um, got a few days left, so hopefully we can come back make a cavy comeback eh all right that's a pretty scenic backdrop right there so i'll catch you guys later you